Hello everyone, it's Isaiah Watson from the Achievement Hunter community and today we're going for the Achievement Cheating Cheeto on Banjo-Kazooie the Xbox version. This achievement will give you 20 gamer score. It requires you to find Cheeto throughout the game three times in order to unlock cheat codes which you're going to use to cheat, you cheating little cheater. First things first, you want to go into Bubble Group Swamp and you're going to learn how to use the boots. Once you've learned the boots, you can come outside Bubble Group Swamp and find the boots in the tunnel near the entrance. You're going to use these boots to walk all the way down this pipe where you're going to find the puzzle for Freeze Easy Peak, which if you head left of that puzzle rather than unlocking the next level, you'll find this boulder. You want to beat back into that boulder in order to find this hidden little cave. But you're a big fat bear, so you're not going to be able to fit through there yet. Go back into Bubble Goose Swamp, turn into crocodile form and come back. So head down the tunnel and here you are, the hidden little cave again. You're going to fit into there like a little crocodile and snap your way down to the other end. Once you're at the other end, you're going to find a flying spell book, which is Witchy's old spell book. And there he is. He'll give you the cheat code blue eggs, which you enter on the sandcastle floor in order to get unlimited blue eggs. The next one, you're going to want to go into Mad Monster Mansion and give Mumbo to turn you into pumpkin form. You then want to go to bounce and hop your way all the way down to the entrance of where you originally find Mad Monster Mansion, back to where you find the puzzle for Gobi Valley. But rather than going towards Gobi Valley, you're going to head the other opposite direction and you're going to find this narrow little hidden path. Quite difficult to navigate through, it took me five or six times, I died quite a lot. But you're going to bounce your way down there, be slow, be calm, don't rush yourself. You've got all the time in the world, it's not like the lava's rising. It is, well it's not really, I'm lying. But anyway, once you get to the end of this path, you've got a little home straight, then you're going to find another little tiny crevice to fit your pumpkin ass into. You're going to head down this tunnel, and at the other end of the tunnel, you'll find Cheeto once again. This time he'll give you the cheat code Red Feathers, which will give you unlimited Red Feathers so you can fly forever. Again, you enter that on the sandcastle floor. Now, you want to head over to the place where you find the Jiggy if you hit the Witchy Switch in Rusty Bucket Bay. It's normally there. Behind it is a um, grate. You can smash that grate. I've already done it. And you're going to head up this tunnel. And at the, ever uh, there, at the other end of this tunnel, you'll find a switch to raise the water level for a third time. You don't actually need to do this to complete the game. So what you're going to do is you're going to, you've got 30 seconds to try and find the next Cheeto book. It's quite easy to do really, but there's not really much room for error. So here we go, you're going to quickly run down to the tunnel, go back to where Rusty Bucket Bay is, head back up and you'll find a little cave here on your right hand side in the top corner. You're going to head in there and then when the counter gets to zero, the water will go back down. Obviously that's what the normal level is. Go up the stairs and guess who it is? It's Cheeto. He'll give you the cheat code for gold feathers, which gives you unlimited invincibility, which is a bit overpowered if you think about it. He will also give you the achievement for 20 gaming score, Cheating Cheeto. And that's it. I might say what? This is Achievement Hunter. To see more, go to AchievementHunter.com. Goodbye.